Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how I treat my scalp when I, whenever I wear protective styles. Right now, I am still rocking my goddess locks. They've been in for two weeks. This particular mixture is composed of five different oils. The first one is grapeseed. The second one is avocado oil. The third oil is Jamaican black castor oil. And then two essential oils, which rosemary and tea tree oil and I will be storing my oil in this plastic four ounce applicator bottle my base oil is going to be the grapeseed oil because it's uh, very light and my hair reacts very well to it I'm going to be using more of this oil than any of the other oils so I'm going to pour two and a half ounces into the bottle uh, grapeseed oil is beneficial because it contains a lot of vitamin E, protects your hair against moisture loss. It contains a type of omega-6 fatty acid that can help combat dryness. The second is going to be avocado. I'm only going to be using one ounce of avocado oil. Avocado oil is good for moisturizing dry, brittle, and damaged hair. It contains many nutrients such as vitamin A, B, D, E, protein, amino acids, iron, copper, magnesium, and folic acid. The third oil is Jamaican black castor oil. And because this oil is so thick, I'm only going to be using a half ounce. So from three and a half to your four ounce mark is going to be Jamaican black castor oil which increases hair growth, it thickens your hair, it reduces and prevents breakage, it deeply conditions and moisturizes your scalp, eliminating dryness, and boosts your hair's overall health. Now on to the essential oils. The first one is going to be rosemary. Rosemary oil is a very good stimulant for hair growth. And the second essential oil is going to be the tea tree oil. Tea tree oil has antibacterial, antiseptic, and antioxidant properties that stimulate hair growth and helps to heal scalp problems such as dryness and flakiness. And because the essential oils are so potent, you only want to use about 10 drops of each. Now that I'm done pouring all of the oils, I'm just going to put the top back on and I'm going to vigorously shake the bottle to make sure all of the oils are evenly distributed. I like using this particular mixture because it allows me to moisturize my hair daily without leaving my hair so oily. And it's also very effective when it comes to combating itchiness. If you guys uh, choose to use this mixture, please let me know how it works for you. This is what personally works for me, but if you decide to tweak it to make it your own, Still let me know how it works and what you did differently. Please like, subscribe, and comment below. Thank you guys for watching.